What up guys, I'm back with another video. Today's gonna be the day that we're gonna be doing the clutch install on the 350, so uh, we already got started, we just... <laughs> you already gonna start, bro. <laughs> we lifted up the car already. Um, we take off the, the white pipe, and right now my homeboy's working on the... I'm taking off the drive shaft. Why are you recording me? I'm a target. You ain't that special, bro. Yeah. So what you doing, bro? I'm gonna take off the bolts off the what the shifter. That way. The, you... what the ten millimeter bolts. That Thanks. way, whenever you listen to the um, the transmission mount, this is not holding it up. It's just take these off, take the transmission mount off, and then we take the housing bolts off. Just pops right off. All right, now what you want to do is just drain the, the transmission fluid. Look, job ready. Look, check me out. Just woke up too. Oh! Yo, weak ass. <laughs> Where the gloves at? You don't block. My gloves, you didn't give me none. You don't need none. That's how you treat your boy? You. Yeah. Thanks. Ooh! Look, you see that bitch don't even look that bad. Hey, Rick. All right, so pretty much... What you're gonna be needing is a is a bearing puller, um, yeah, some brake fluid, dot three brake fluid, some thread locker, some grease, a pump to add your uh, transmission fluid, oh, some gloves if you want. We want to get dirty. A uh, damn torque wrench to what uh, torque your uh, flywheel bolts to the proper spec or whatnot, and then you want to get some brake cleaner to clean your uh, flywheel and uh, the pressure plate and some what is it? Fluid. Yeah, training fluid. Oh my god! Some training fluid. Sleep, man. Uh, three fifties apparently HRs take what three quarts, so we got three. We're gonna get this done. Got a transmission jack that we're gonna put to use that we just bought from Harbor Freight. So pretty much everything that that I bought, all the tools that I bought, is from Harbor Freight. You know what I'm saying? Boy. If we had got this, bro, you know how much we would have struggled? Yeah, that is true, because I wasn't going to buy it. But then Harbor Freight said 20% off. Hi, bet. Hey, man, somebody tell me what kind of shit this mechanic doing, man, because... Check, check, check our stations out. Look, look like, <laughs> look what the fuck, bro? Hey, this shit working, though, bitch. What the fuck is this, dog? Oh. Well, hold on, hold on. I, you know how much money I'm saving your ass, dog? You know I don't got a 2 by 4 to hold up my hood higher than what it's supposed to, right? But check this out. Bro, what's Dog, what the fuck? All right, so pretty much what you want to do is get a, I guess, a wannabe breaker bar, and just put some duct tape on it to your wrench, to your ratchet. I'm sorry, and make sure they're uh, 17 millimeters, and then that's what you're gonna be using to take off uh, all of the transmission bolts. FedEx, bet. Oh shit, nah, bro. Right here, bro. Where, where the 350 at, man? Come on, FedEx. You missed the house, bro. Don't you see the 350 getting worked on and shit? It's stupid, man. Oh, they coming. I wonder what he gonna bring me. Alright, bitch. Alright, look. FedEx just dropped off another delivery. My boy pissed off because he ain't got the mods I got. You know what I'm saying? Got a big ass turbo in there, beat. You know what I'm saying? Just got a clutch. Gonna get some Federals. Gonna get a turbo. Stage 2. I should've went stage 3, but fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Turbo on the way. Hi, bit. Perfect.
so we got the, the transmission out and that's we're gonna take off the old slave cylinder and just replace it with the heavy duty slave cylinder looks like it's just one bolt here one bolt there and I guess I'm plugged just to plug and play I guess <laughs> and uh, put some grease on it on the whole whatever this is what you doing bro all right so like I said it was just to uh, put a light coat of, of all-purpose grease in, in your I don't know what the hell this is what's that called I just call it a fork bro. all right whatever your fork and then uh, and we want to put a light coat of, of grease inside of here just for better, a better, I guess, engagement, I guess you could say, right? According to Edwin. So yeah guys, we right here on a little break because we got a little tired, but transmission's on, slave is on, about to take the flyway off, got some lazy bastards here, but you know, no help needed. So we just came to Lowe's real quick, we had to get a, a damn uh, adapter for the torque wrench, something that goes from like half to three eighths, so we can uh, what, torque, the, torque, torque the flywheel bolts and get it done. All right, guys. So we ran into a little situation where we can't get the flywheel bolts out. It looks like they're the thread lock. Uh, well, the thread lock that had that the bolt has, I guess, is like that hardcore thread lock. So well, right now we're struggling. So I caught up a homeboy. See if he could he could give us a hand with that because we can't take it out. All right. So we're gonna be taking out the pilot bushing with the. Uh, the bearing puller. He's the blue person. Alright, get it done, get it done, get it done. Oh. Man, now you broke your phone. Man, fuck you. Yeah, there you go, look. Just let it dry, I guess. Fish. But yeah, guys, we got the clutch in. Fuck no. I beat. But uh, we torqued the flywheel bolts to 40 foot pounds and the pressure plate bolts to 26 foot pounds. Um, we're gonna we're gonna stop here to, for today. Uh, we're gonna just put in the training tomorrow. Uh, we've been here for a pretty pretty long time. All right, guys, we got the clutch in. We got the training in, drive shaft in. First start up. Go, B. Yeah, no white pipe, no white pipe. Open, open what? Test pipes? I'm gonna yell it. Huh? The two bugs. Come on. <laughs> Peep the mop. Hi, B. That shit sounds ugly as fuck. Second go start, all right.
I mean, just leave a comment down below and I'll make sure to, to answer your concerns. Um, but yeah, guys, see you next time. And uh, oh, and uh, y'all go subscribe to my homie, my homeboy's YouTube channel. He got videos on the ATV and his, his 350Z, the Nismo. So yeah, go leave a leave a like, leave a leave a like, subscribe, share. You know what I'm saying? A, a man trying to blow up.